In today's culture, we all love recording videos and capturing those moments. Especially when you're a content creator like me, you sure have faced the issue of such shaky videos from time to time. So in this video, we will make a DIY version of a motorized gimbal under thirty dollars, which will help you achieve stable and awesome videos for your action camera. So let's get started. A gimbal is an electronic device which helps to obtain stunning and stabilized footage using motors and few sensors to smooth out the axis of movement. To make a DIY gimbal, we will need the following parts and equipments: a 2-axis FPV BGC with gimbal motors and aluminum mounts. We will need batteries to power this project and we will also need a joystick module and Arduino to further control this gimbal. First, bring in the FPV BGC assembly. Our BGC has accelerometer and gyroscope under the base plate which loops the input to gimbal motors. This unit has a BGC driver on board so we do not worry about the controls and the code of this section. So if you connect a battery to this assembly, it is already acting like a gimbal for action cameras but it is not self sufficient and it can turn into a nightmare if proper configuration isn't done so we will first configure the system and make sure everything works as needed first connect the bgc to your computer using a usb cable open the bgc software which can be downloaded using the link below Next, connect your board and go to the basic settings page and adjust the motor configuration. Try adjusting the power level as per your need or simply copy the same settings as mine. Now our gimbal is working as needed, but yet it would be awesome to have tilt and pan motion which can be obtained by giving PWM or PPM input to RX roll and RX pitch pins which can be produced with the help of a simple code on Arduino and input can be drawn from joystick module to simplify the connections i designed a pcb and ordered it then soldered everything Loaded the code on Arduino and voila, we have a PWM signal which controls the pitch and roll of our gimbal. Now that the connections are done, it looks like our gimbal is crazy dancing on speed. It's because we have maximized our degree of freedom and also the speed of motion looks way too fast. Let's turn it down by using the BGC software. Go to the RC settings tab and adjust the speed over here. Keep it as low as possible. Cherry on cake would be to add services like switching the gimbal on or off, adjusting the gimbal by hand. Doesn't that sound fascinating already? It is fairly simple to achieve this task using the onboard switch on the BGC controller, which can be replaced by a switch, which is easily done by soldering extra wires to the pad. After few software tweaks in service tab, we can achieve this required result. Now our gimbal is functional and as required, but seriously, would anyone carry this mess of wires and batteries around? Let's just make an enclosure for this device. Since I do not have a 3D printer, I will use PVC pipes along with a few joints and my personal favorite, hot glue gun. I wish to make this handle look like a selfie stick so it would be easy to carry and it will enclose the batteries inside along with the circuit. At last we will use few self threading bolts and mount the base plate of gimbal to the PVC surface and finally stuff everything inside. Once done, the entire device in all looks like this. But 
this isn't quite near any commercial gimbal in terms of finishing and looks definitely it's a huge throwback but seriously what else can you expect in 30 dollars let's call this project a version 1 we will soon make a version 2 of this exact gimbal or maybe we can add a third axis and we can also add a 3d printed case we will try to make it look as finished product as a commercial gimbal anyways long story short our 2 axis diy gimbal looks and works just awesome here is the side by side footage taken with and without a gimbal from my action camera and clearly the results are 100 times better So guys I hope you enjoyed this simple yet effective DIY gimbal build for under $30. Do comment and share your thoughts on this build and if you like this video don't forget to hit the like button because we bring such awesome content on this channel every week. Subscribe now it's absolutely free. Until the next one goodbye.